hello guys welcome to sam's class again please uh if you love these videos and if they are helping you please like share and recommend then you subscribe and make sure you comment if you have any question ask i will uh surely respond to you personally and if you want me to make a video about anything i will surely make a video so today we are here again our task for today is how to create a directory we are creating a new directory that is in the, the directory name is school is amazing can't you see it's very amazing so let's get to class so you got to go to your sandbox you open your web time my web time is open there already so remember you go into your root with your cd or cd roots automatically you are in the root directory so now they want us to create another directory named school is amazing so for you to make or to create a directory you you come here so sorry guys so in your for you to make your directory again um you just list what is inside your directory to know what is there you see it we just have school and the uh, school so cool and so on so we want to make a directory for us to make a directory the command for making a directory is mkdir that's make directory then you put in your space it's your you understand automatically that you are, you are going to make a directory and what's the name of the directory you are supposed to make um where is it um okay school is amazing so we come there and just type school is make sure the underscore is there is typed according to how it is or the name any type of name you want to give your directory you can give any type of name you want to give your file you can give amazing and make sure that you are distinct with your spellings and your case so you press enter automatically your directory is made so when you click uh so if you have an error that means you are you are not getting the right thing there but now you can see that when i click my when i go to when i put in my ls command you can see my directory your school is amazing so you can come here and click on done then you check your code start a new test if you have having any error but i i can recommend that the the solution i give is very very correct so can you see everything is fine congratulations all tests are passed successfully you are ready for your next mission please like share subscribe and comment if you like this video and uh, don't forget to subscribe and don't forget to connect in the next class Thank you. See you in the next class.